while honoring those who have truly laid it all on the line for our freedom. That's the real meaning of Memorial Day as thousands of Hoosiers pay their respects. Eyewitness News reporter Rich Van Wyk tells us why Vietnam vets are getting special recognition this year. When heroes fall, it is said words fail. On this Memorial Day, words and deeds brought tears and comfort and joy to their comrades and loved ones. Any gold star parents or family's biggest fear is that people will forget. And uh, it's been 10 years. Since Dan and Janice Shawwecker's son was killed in Afghanistan. But people appreciate our soldiers and the families. Absolutely. But appreciation for one group of veterans, said one speaker, is long deserved and way overdue. Thomas, Dean, Clem. Still missing. At Crown Hill Cemetery, hundreds listened solemnly. Philip and Alan Ducat. Still missing. As Still Vietnam missing. vets. Paul Frederick Johns. Still missing. Held roll James, call. James Reed Johnson. Still missing. For the 50 Hoosier soldiers still missing in action. Retired Major Christopher Barthouse called these veterans soldiers of unquestionable valor who endured unconscionable betrayal. Then asked the crowd. And if you're close enough, reach to one of them, shake their hand, tell them something they didn't hear 50 years ago. Something that's long overdue. Steve Mabry, shot and sent home with a purple heart, was ecstatic. I've had um, little girls tag me on the arm, and, and I look around, and they said, my dad said, I see a Vietnam veteran, hug him and welcome him home. On the 50th anniversary of America's commitment to fight the Vietnam War, vets received a special pin commemorating their service and a promise not to be forgotten. Rich Van White, Channel 13, Eyewitness News.